It might sound too philosophical, but it's an acting, acting, or acting, an acting. Actually, you see, I mean, it's a combination of both. I mean, here it is the natural instinct, and here is control. You are to combine the two in harmony. Not if you have one to the extreme, you will be very unscientific. If you have another to the extreme, you become all of a sudden a mechanical man, no longer a human being. So you. It is a successful combination of both. So therefore, it's not pure naturalness or unnaturalness. The ideal is unnatural naturalness or natural unnaturalness. You do not have style. You just say, "Well, here, here I am. You know, as a, as a human being, how can I express myself totally and completely?" Now that way, you won't create a style because style is a crystallization. You know, I mean that way. It's a process of continuing growth. Hand-wise, it's very slow. How is it? And you push it out, but all the time you are keeping the continuity going, bending, stretching, everything. You know, suppose you know. I mean, you you just keep it moving. It's like a ballet dancer there. Yeah, it is. I mean, to to them, you see, the idea is running water never grows stale. So you gotta just keep on flowing. To me, okay, to me. Ultimately, martial art means honestly expressing yourself. Now, it is very difficult to do. I mean, it is easy for me to put on a show and be cocky yeah. and be flooded with a cocky feeling and then feel like pretty cool or an organ. Or I can make all kinds of phony things. You see what I mean? Blinded by it. Or I can show you some really fancy movement. To express oneself honestly, not lying to oneself, and to express myself honestly, that, my friend, is <laughs> very hard to do. And you have to train. You have to keep your reflexes so that when you want it, it's there. When you want to move, you are moving. And when you move, you are determined to move. Not taking one inch, not anything less than that. If I want to punch. I'm gonna do it, man, and I'm gonna do it. You see, so I mean, so that is the type of thing you have to train yourself into it to become one with the. You think? It was very unlucky. Your mind be formless, shapeless, like water. Now you put water into a cup, it becomes the cup. You put water into a bottle, it becomes the bottle. You put it in a teapot, it becomes the teapot. Now water can flow. Or it can crash. Be water, my friends.